Hey guys, Solomon here. Welcome back to Let's Play Terraria. Alright, so now it's day three. Um, just survived another night. Uh, tell you what though, I am kind of getting tired of just walking around on the surface doing absolutely nothing. So, you know what? Uh, let's see what I have here. Uh, let's get some torches. Do, 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 do. Let's make sure I have plenty of... Uh, what have we got here? Um, I'll hold on to what I got there. Um, what I do, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna make some supplies so I can start exploring some actual caves because, well, we've done pretty well so far. However, um, well, if I'm going to really get much of anything in this game, uh, usually you're gonna have to start looking underground. In fact, uh, okay, this is just a nice little drop in the ground here. Oh, wait, I came over this way already. Right. And eh, let's just keep going, actually. Alright, so my goal right now is to find a nice little cave I can explore for most of this day and maybe into the night, depending. Uh, don't want to go down there, because that's probably going to lead to death. Uh, what was this rock again? Eh, probably just stone. Oh well. Collect some more mushrooms. Got a little lake here. And we have breath, like in Minecraft. Ooh, look at all the mushrooms. Unlike most other mushrooms, these you can actually eat without a horrible side effect of delirium. But damn, there's a lot of mushrooms here. Alright, and ooh, more clay. Alright, I'm gonna probably want more of that since that's so good for building houses and such. And there's a, another blue slime. Let's just uh, hug the wall here. Okay, no, he made that jump up there, so he's out of my way then. Not gonna collect too much clay though. After all, I got only so much sunlight I have to go through here. So gotta make sure I don't lose an opportunity to get underground where I can probably get some good stuff. Of course, it doesn't hurt to dig through this clay because um, sometimes it can be good to have that. Um, alright. Let this guy come down here and settle. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do at all. Alright, um. Okay, no problem. Darn. Oh, crap. Oof. Alright, that will do it. Just gotta be a little clever with these wooden platforms. Uh, I think I'm good on wood for a while, so let's just keep going this way. Hmm. Oh hey, here's a nice little pit into the ground. Okay, careful. Ooh, it's getting dark already. Yep, that, sir, is a pit. Ooh. Now, um, for the slimes, um, a pattern to realize is that they will, um, jump towards you. Uh, no, that's the same color stone, never mind. Ooh, that was close. But uh, the way slimes work, um, in terms of a, a actual pattern of jumping and whatnot, they will um, jump at um, into the wall uh, a few times, and they'll reverse direction. But basically, their whole goal is just to get out of there. I don't know. I'm not going to elaborate too much on it. So going into a cavern. Eh, I'll probably stop though if I hit walls of water like that. So. Just cause, well, I can't breathe underwater yet. Well, I can, but not for very long. Let's just see what there is under here. Some pots. But not much else, so not really worth the time and effort. And since there's a dirt back wall at this level, um, nothing to worry about there. Uh, 
Thanks. No, you don't kill me. I kill you. Thank you for being such a great volunteer for death. Alright, let's move on. Eh, I'm losing sunlight, though. I want to hur hurry up and find something to explore. Mm, some pots. I suppose that's better than nothing. Okay, got some air pockets. Uh, gonna have to uh, build platforms here. And go. There we go. Alright, got a bit of a deep lake here. Just putting up some platforms ahead of time so I can get out. I was really kind of hoping to find something better to explore. So far I've only found a few bits of copper and a few caves I can't really even go down. Oh, oh shit. Unfortunately, unlike Minecraft, we don't have boats. So, uh, looks like that's a dead end for some time. Until I either get more health or until, well, we just find some ability to super breathe or something. Well, let's just head back to the uh, left here, I, the right, I guess. Oh man, this rate, the sun's gonna go down before I can even make any real progress underground. It's gonna suck. <sighs> Seriously, I have no idea how I got on this world, but I'm gonna have to find some supplies somewhere, and I don't think I'm gonna find enough of them on the surface. I'm gonna have to find a good place underground, but the game's not giving me any good places, sir. No, that was just a clay pit, right? I want to get some more clay later, but not right now. Oh, shit. This is not good. Because that's trees there, I can't very well excavate that place. I kind of tap it like that. Now I need to chop down this tree so that I can actually dig my way there. There we go. Get my sword back on. Oh gosh. Now you can actually dig out the dirt and that will help get rid of the water. The, the water is more fluid in this game than it is in Minecraft, so... In that sense, you can actually get rid of it a little more easily simply by digging out to the side and whatnot. It's not just going to be some strange flow. It, the, the water mechanics are definitely different and that's... It makes it sometimes easier, uh, easier to work with at times. Looks like I'm back at the house, though. Yeah, I'm just about back at the house. Yep, there's the sunflowers. Ugh, I've already wasted half the day, and I really haven't got anything to show for it. Darn. Okay, well, let's just go in for round two, then, I guess. Uh, okay, that was just a pit where I found some stone, right? Um, hmm. Gotta find some good stuff, and I need to hurry with it. Oh, no, wait, I, I kind of already explored over this one. Oh, actually, I can go underground, that's right. I forgot if I was doing surface exploration or not. Oh, yeah, here's that one cave, but it had this sheer drop-off here. Am I ready to explore down here yet? Well, only one way to know. Now, a pretty uh, fun thing to do to uh, help out with uh, exploring is this little trick here where you can place wooden platforms right below wooden platforms. And in that sense, um, you can actually sort of uh, make your way down uh, safely. And here comes up a blue slime. Let's go ahead and knock him away so that we don't have to worry about him uh, immediately. And now that I've done that, he's going to come after me actively now, so... Let's just take him out so that I can move on. Really slow attack speed. Still, this is better than that stupid little short sword. You see, eventually you get the ability to make short sword in this game, which... Um... 
are faster and sometimes a little more powerful than the broadswords. But where the broadsword here has sort of like a swing motion, the short sword has a stabbing motion instead. So, um, the problem with the short sword is simply that you just don't get a lot of range. In fact, in fact, I can't even say it's range. Oh, damn. Yeah, this is just turning into a drop-off now. Oh, apparently there's a ledge there, though, somewhere. Ooh, how'd I do that? Alright, just kinda kinda get my bearings here. Ooh. So yeah, as you can see, the uh, hammer doesn't do a lot of damage, and it's really slow, so... Not really a good weapon, per se. How am I already out of platforms? Oh, I haven't even really gotten down below the surface yet, even. Well, the good news is, wooden platforms are one of the things you can make without really even needing um, a workbench, so... The only problem is, this early on in the game, you really kind of got to rely on the light of your torches. Oh, damn it. I got a sworn I hit him. Alright. Alright, got some more cobweb. Sheesh, they're not stopping. Why won't you leave me alone? Okay, good, I got some health back. Oh, come on, there's more slimes. Slimes! Okay. That's just kind of a... Oh, that's not what I meant to do, but okay. I'm still alive, that's good. What is over here? Uh, health. Okay, that's not bad, I guess. And well, let's just go back for these, I guess, real quickly. I didn't quite mean to cut that, I guess. Oh, shit! Oh crap! Oh shit, shit, shit! Get out of here! Okay, not quite the surprise I was hoping for, but nah. So yeah, you want to make sure you have torches. They really help you when you can't really see that well. And more potions, awesome. I don't really mean to smash these with a sword, but sometimes I just can't help myself. Well, so far, I'm doing pretty okay, I suppose. Here's another sh bit of a drop-off. So far, I still haven't found anything really that great. Come on. Stop holding back on me. Well, we're definitely getting deeper now. In fact, this is just now a sheer drop-off. Let's just check the other way. I don't like to take really sharp drop-offs. Uh, for pretty obvious reasons. One, there's fall damage, which can very easily kill you in this game. You think the fall damage in Minecraft's bad? Oh, it gets worse in this game. You fall one square too far, you'll... At this point in the game, you'll lose, like, almost all your health. Eh, I'm not sure if this drop-off is actually much better. Whoa! All right. Oh shit! It's night time now. What's worse is that it's night time, and we're still technically above the stone layer. Uh, to make better sense of what that means, basically, 
we can still hear the daytime music and the nighttime music from above ground. And what that means is that we're technically not high enough, deep down enough to where um, we're going to escape the zombies. So they're going to be coming after us even down here. See, there are some of them right now. We're also going to have those demon eyes down here too. And you've seen how easily those guys will kick our asses. So we want to really escape them. We're going to have to get down deeper a little faster. Uh, is that some ore up there? I think that is. Oh shit. Demon eyes. Gosh darn it. Oh shit. Darn it. You see this sword is not that fast. It's really why I kind of want to get a new one soon. The wooden sword's a good thing. It's really better than anything else you're gonna have. With ex the exception of the pickaxe, potentially, because it is much faster. But, um, yeah, you really want a really good... Oh, no, wait, this is just stone. Damn it, I thought that was ore. Well, look at that. Solomon screwed up again. What's over here? Oh, zombies. That's what's over there. Oh god! Whew. Oh shit. They're falling from the sky! And you really want to have torches- Oh shit. That was- <laughs> Okay, that was bad. Oh shit. This is why you want potions. They will heal you almost full- Well, they will heal you fully at this point, so... Really nice to have. In any case, now that I have potions, this game is a little less lethal. But only just barely. Span that out a little so that it's easier to see what we're doing here. Alright, only a bit of copper. Lame. Okay, that's a water passage. Well, let's see what we have in here. And now we're gonna have to climb up, I guess. Yeah, these vines get in the way. Because of that, how they... Ooh, lots of cobweb. Yeah, I'm gonna have to break a bit of this wall down. Break down this wall. Yeah, I think this just loops around with that little passage under there. In that case, let's just drop down and see where it goes. Uh, nowhere. Ah, oh, shit. We're gonna have an underwater battle here. Oh, great. Look, the little eye guy wants in on it, too. Yeah, no thanks. I don't want what you're selling. I do not want what you're selling, Mr. Eyeball. Yeah, why don't you get stuck up there? It's for your own good. Oh god, where are these zombies coming from? They shouldn't be able to follow me up here. Okay, good, he fell down. And now this guy is free. Oh, shit. Yeah, you want to be a little careful. If they get behind you when you hit them, you can, uh... Mix up. Did I hear something just now? I don't think I did. I'm a little scared, but it's no reason to be scared, right? It's just zombies. Only zombies. Okay, there's a pot up there. And another one of those stupid demon eyes. <sighs> Oh, wait a minute. What the hell's that? Okay, that's just a... Uh, something fading through the image there. I thought for a second that I actually found something special, like a map piece or something. Okay, you know what? You just get out of my face. Uh. 
die. There. Now let's just get up there and see what that is. Nothing really valuable in these vases, but you know what? It, it never hurts. Alright, well in any case, let's just uh, take a quick inventory here, see what I got. Um, yeah, I picked up bombs not long ago. Um, those could be pretty okay. Don't think I'm gonna use them that much, though. Eh, I'll equip them anyway, though. Just for, uh, having them handy. Alright, so far the way looks clear. Oh, wait, I do actually need more torches. Which explains why, um, ooh, hey, look, I found iron! Wow, that hit him pretty damn hard. Heh, <laughs> I got him trapped. Yeah, you see, what's wonderful about weapons like the Mind Pick is they don't do as much damage as the sword, but they're really fast, and you can usually trap enemies, which makes them pretty valuable. And there's more iron right there. Ooh, kind of close. And I also want to try to save these platforms when I can, because, well, they're very useful. More iron! I don't know if that was iron over there either, was that? I can't tell. It's too dark. I'm gonna have to drop down. Oh, well, here's some more iron. And some silver, too. Alright, I hit a little jackpot here. Here's that little cache I was looking for. Holy shit! What the hell's that down there? See that, viewers? Way down here? That's a demon altar. You do not want to mess with demon altars. Not where we are right now. Long story short, viewers, those things will summon bosses. You see, uh, to put it like this, demon altars are kind of like uh, crafting tables. Except you can only craft, well they don't let you craft anything special except boss summons. If you have the right materials in your inventory, you can craft summoning items which will let you get to bosses. And, you know, that's not really good, is it? Kind of, yeah, I'm not really that deep down even still. I'm, I'm still not that deep down. I'm kind of disappointed. I was expecting to be a little uh, further down by now. You see, let me put it like this. Sorry to change the topic like this, but note the background is still made entirely of dirt. Well, the fact is, if I was uh, actually at a pretty good depth, um, you see, I would be um, a little. I wouldn't have. It. Is that? Are those? Is that? Two demons, demon shrines right next to each other. What the hell? Um, normally they shouldn't spawn like that, but okay. Yeah, that is odd. That's really odd. Yeah, that's really odd. Seriously, it's one thing to find one, but then find three. Have them all next to each other? What the hell? Well, it looks like it's day four now on Minecraft. Uh, not Minecraft. Terraria. I almost slipped up again. <laughs> 